How's everyone doing today? We have got some capture the flag game on estate, or as the Spaniards sometimes refer to it as estate, um, with an accent over the E, or an accent over the A in Colombia. I'm just joking, I made that up. But I have to say it was pretty creative, and I don't know why I'm giving myself compliments right now. I probably sound like a dick. Um, we are playing capture the flag on estate, and the game type I'm playing is um, team tactical and what that is is kind of like a it's mainly a 4v4 playlist I think that's the max it can be I'm not sure don't quote me on that one but um, it's kind of a try hard playlist um, you can get a number of things between you know capture the flag search and destroy team deathmatch and stuff like that pretty much any game type and you um, you probably want to go in as a team. It's, it's not fun to go in alone because um, there's a lot of tryhards in this playlist. Usually there is, and it's but it's definitely fun if you guys are looking for some good competitive match matchmaking and go in with some friends and you know um, turn on the tryhard switch next to your, your computer or your TV screen and you know just let the other team just have no mercy on them like we do this game. Um, so I'll get into the gameplay because since this is a basically a tryhard playlist, um, I'll kind of and it is called Team Tactical. I'll, you know, try to tell you my tactics for this game. Um, let's see, Estate, Capture the Flag. There's obviously an advantage one way or the other. Whether um, excuse me, just drink some Coke. Carbon dioxide is coming back into my throat. Um, you know, what was I talking about? Yes. Okay, so this map is a hill. It, it is definitely a hill. There is one flag over there on top of the hill. That's our flag. And there's this flag down here at the bottom of the hill. And, you know, you can argue either way. Which way is easier? But, you know, you just want to have good tactics for each way. You see right here, I'm, I'm setting up in this building, telling my teammate to run it run it right by me and basically killing anyone who spawns underneath me and sometimes in this type of gameplay you need to you know run and gun and there's other times it's really called for um, you know it's really important to just chill out and kinda camp a little bit because you know if you're winning then you know that's all, that's what you need to do to win because in team tactical um, you know I would suggest going for the win um, it's it's kind of it's not, kind of not the type of gameplay game type you want to go into and um, go for a good kill death ratio. Um, even though I I do get a pretty good kill death ratio this game, um, I just you know it's not like I was just going for my kill death ratio. I was trying to you know play and help the team and so yeah. Um, so right now it's two fly caps to zero. And as as I was saying before, you know what we're doing we're running downhill picking up picking it up and running it uphill. Um, one way or the other, you have to go up and down the hill, or down and up. So, you know, I don't know if it's easier one way or the other. I kind of think it's easier to run down, pick it up, and go back up, just because you start up, and um, it's easier to defend when your flag is up top. That's just the way I look at it, because you've got that huge estate up there. And So yeah, right now I, I'm kind of taking a risk. I take their flag, and I don't have any teammates with me, but I pull off some MLG Pro stuff, and I'm just joking, I'm not MLG Pro. I know I posted that, you know, EMP of me noob tubing, and apparently someone was butt hurt and said that I wasn't MLG Pro for getting an EMP with noob tubes, and I realized that it, w it was a joke, but you know, I, I understand if people don't get the jokes. Um, so right now, I have to speed this up just because you know got to get under that 10 minute mark and don't really get any kills. But you saw there that I did call in my emergency airdrop and basically first half of this game is a, you know good kills and stuff and the second half of this game is going to be me helping my team with the stuff I got into my emergency airdrop. So you see I called it in there my predator in the beginning there. 
maybe hoping to get some kind of multi-kill because, you know, they all do spawn fairly close to each other. Um, but, you know, that didn't happen. But um, basically my tactics for this half of the game is whenever my team's going to take the flag, I'm going to call in one of my air supports behind them and, you know, make sure that we cap it. And I think this is it's a really good tactic to use. Um, when you're playing games like this, um, you know, I would suggest um, sticking to air support that you don't have to sit on a computer to use. I mean, I'm sure you guys could rape them in an AC-130 on this map and or a chopper gun or whatever, but on this map, you really want to use teamwork and stuff. And when you're sitting on a computer in a corner, you know, I mean, I, I realize the irony in that because really right now we're all sitting at our houses um, with a controller in our hands playing it on a TV. But, you know, what I'm trying to say is that you... Um, sorry, kind of I speak Chinese sometimes when I fake Chinese when I don't know what to say. But you'll probably hear more of that in the near future, so... You know, I've been working on it. I think I've still got a little bit to learn. Um, I'm just joking, guys. If any of you guys are Chinese, just don't don't get mad at me for that. I don't speak Chinese at all. So, yeah. So basically, right here, um, we're doing the same thing as we did, but on the opposite as before. We're, you know, camping up by their spawn when, as one of our guys rushes, takes the flag and runs it back. Um, I completely forgot to tell you guys about my weapon setup. Um, the last gameplay that I posted of Team Tactical, it's the exact same setup. Setup. Um, <laughs> it's the UMP with FMJ. I've got Stopping Power, Ninja Pro, and Marathon Pro um, with a Semtex grenade. And the other stuff, you know, smoke, and smoke grenade is pretty cool. But So you'll see, you'll see here what I'm doing. We take the flag, and I call in a Predator missile, you know, kill the nearest guy to the flag. And that's basically what's going to happen for pretty much the rest of the game. Um, this is, is this turned into a pretty laid-back game, and I, and, I, and I realize that maybe it's not super fun to watch. Um, right here, we've got a guy going for our flag, so I just decided to take him out with my Predator missile. I've got plenty of air support to use, so, you know, why not? Um, but yeah, as I was saying before, you don't want to be sitting on your computer. And you see one of my teammates calls in a Pavlo. That is one of the best kill streaks to use when you're playing Team Tactical because it's it's by far you know the best air support in my opinion. Just because you don't have to sit in a corner to use it, you can be getting kills while your Pavlo gets kills. It stays in the air up in the air for a while. It's easy, you know. It's it's not like the attack helicopter where it, you know, it only gets hit markers, it actually kills people. So overall it's just it's just really a great you know great kill streak. Um so yeah, right now we're just chilling I guess. I don't know where I'm flying that predator missile, but I should, I probably shouldn't be a pilot when I grow up. I don't plan on it. Um but yeah, so basically chilling next to their spawn. This other team, I guess, is kind of con confused. They don't know what to do. I realize I've got some more air support to call in, but it seems like this game is coming to a close. Um, so I'll probably just call in the rest of my air support. Um, maybe I won't. Maybe I'll go get this care package. Predator missile. That's awesome. Um, so thank you, thank you for watching, guys. Um, please give this a thumbs up. If we can get over 50 thumbs up, I will... Um, give you guys a virtual hug and you know please comment last time I only got like four comments and you know I read all my comments all my messages so you know send send me some comments or post some comments or whatever you know I love reading them even if they say you know screw you it's awesome so love you guys see you next video peace juicy box bye a lot